Hey guys, I wanted to do a video just today to uh, show what these, I think one of the most underused things in home kitchens are, or I'm absolutely fanatical about these things. They're called gastronome pans. They're also known as GN pans or uh, chef pans. Anybody who's worked in a professional kitchen, even I remember working as a pool lifeguard, I used to see these things uh, in, the, in the kitchen all the time. Or if you've just ever ordered a sandwich at Subway or, uh, you know, got salad out, you'll surely recognize these tubs. So these ones on the right are called, uh, these are six. Now we keep kosher, so that's why these stickers are on saying whether they're meat or dairy or a uh, parv. But, uh, you know, most people obviously don't keep kosher. Uh, this is a quarter one. They're expressed as fractions of a whole pan, which is a one over one. So this is a quarter, and I think a quarter is like kind of a decent size for, uh, you know, a couple, keeping a couple of meals in. Uh, a whole pan's really big. A six is the ones you see on sandwich counters. And the way I use these, basically, these are aluminium, and I'll just use these to store food. So i actually show you guys, excuse the dilapidated state of our fridge. So we actually currently have one, two, three, four, no less, uh, gastronome pans. So we just use these for kind of holding ingredients in the fridge. The beautiful thing about these is their versatility. One, they're oven proof. Two, they're apparently freezer proof. Um, and yeah, they're just so modular. They're like fit together. You can put them on top of each other. Uh, so this one I prepared yesterday, some salad. I believe this is salad. Yep, it's just chopped up some salad. So these things are amazing for like what I believe chefs call mise en place for uh, getting ingredients, prepping ingredients before you need them. So that's what I use them for really. So amidst the beer, what you're looking at here is uh, you have to buy the labels separately, typically. Uh, so what we're doing here now is just kind of prepping some food, doing a bit of food prep. The kitchen is in a bit of disarray at the moment. So what I'm doing here is uh, preparing just a batch of pasta. And what I'm going to do when this pasta is finished is just kind of put a whole batch of pasta into a gastronome pan. And then I'll, uh, you know, be able to serve out of that for a few days and I can put it together in a salad bowl with other ingredients. As I mentioned, technically speaking, 5% feta cheese is already not considered low fat, but it's, uh, you know, it's a decent enough dinner. So yeah, these are gastronome pans. I've been using them for... Um, about five years, honestly, and they've become like indispensable in our kitchen. I love these. They're great. Uh, you get these things in restaurant supply stores, catering supply places will have these. You'll see them in other materials besides aluminium. You'll see them in plastic. Personally, I like the aluminum ones best. And you can just slot them in your fridge. I mean, I don't know what else to say about them, but they're... Oh, you can, you can also bring these. I also use these to like bring these, bring food to a potluck. So I'll like pop one of these into an Ikea bag. And I like just bring them to a potluck. They're amazing for storage, but uh, they're not, you know, you want to keep these upright because that's not like totally secure. This is a uh, bulgur. This is, if I can move the salad out of the way, there's like lentils in this one and some other, something else in this. I'm not sure what, oh, quinoa. So yeah, great things. I love them. They're great. Buy them. You won't regret it.